my channel. It's Sam. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. For today's video, I decided to do a very like natural glam. Before we get started, please don't forget to subscribe in the little button down there. And if you want to know how I got this look, then just keep on watching. So as you can see, I have already done my brows off camera. If you guys haven't seen my brow routine, I'm going to link it up here. I did like a um, how I actually put together my brows, like my brow, brow routine plus how like I maintain them. Um, I actually did that routine like a couple days ago because my brows were getting out of control. I'm gonna get ready. It's just gonna be a super like natural look. We're gonna go on a little date night today and I'm like excited because I have been craving ramen and ugh, I can already taste it. It's so good. We're gonna go to TJ and just have like a night out. I already moisturized my face. I'm gonna go ahead and put a little bit of primer and this is the Milk um, Hydro Grip primer because I'm gonna wear a little bit of foundation um, like I'm not gonna like cake it on <laughs> today uh, I'm gonna put a pore minimizing primer as well and then for the second primer I'm gonna use the elf poreless primer and there goes the ice cream man I'm so excited because I bought tickets to go watch the Lion King tomorrow um, today's Friday and I really wanted to go today but um, they were like completely sold out and yeah so but I bought them for uh, tomorrow which I'm so excited I hope that it's as good as it was like Aladdin because I loved Aladdin and I'm just really excited I'm gonna take my next can't stop won't stop I'm gonna grab just a little bit and I'm just gonna dot it just like that and I'm not gonna use a lot of foundation today uh, just enough so that it can cover kind of like my redness like I said it's gonna be more of a natural look today and this foundation gives you a lot of coverage anyways like a little bit goes a long way I'm so excited I'm watching Jane the Virgin right now like I'm all cut up and I'm currently watching the last episode from this week <laughs> oh my God. like if you guys don't watch Jane the Virgin I totally recommend it it's such a good show I love that it's so like it brings so much of the telenovela culture and I love it because it's so like American but it's like so Mexican at the same time like with the telenovela style. Um, such a good show. Put a little bit of concealer and I'm just gonna dot a little bit under my eyes because I do have a little bit of discoloration there and I'm just gonna blend that. I need a closer closer mirror and I'm just gonna blend that and bring a little bit of that of that on my lid as my kind of like a primer for my lids I haven't watched Stranger Things and I think I want to start it this weekend at least one episode I know that everybody that has watched it or that I've seen like has watched it like has like been watched the whole season <laughs> And I think I did I like we did that the first season of Stranger Things. I'm gonna set that with a little bit of my powder, the Maybelline Fit Me powder, and I'm just gonna grab a little bit. I'm not gonna bake or anything. And this is a Morphe M554. And then just set my under eyes a little bit. If I'm in a rush, usually I usually do this, like I do a little bit of foundation just so that I can cover my redness. Um, I've been doing that lately because I don't know I've been like in a rush in the mornings lately um, and so like that's what I've been doing so I'm gonna grab a little bit of my studio fix powder and I usually use a like packing this is an E34 and it's like a packer brush so like I usually like go like this and just like pack it to get like full coverage but because I want a more natural look today, I'm going to use a very fluffy brush. This is from Real Techniques. These were one of the first, like, brushes that I used. So it's really fluffy, so it's just, it's not going to put a lot of, like, coverage on our skin. It's just going to blend the powder really nicely all over. And I just want to have enough to, like, set that a little bit of foundation that we put. And I'm just using not a lot of pressure. I'm like actually like doing it very, very, very lightly to set everything. Just so that I can give a little bit of color to my face. And I'm using the Hoola Benefit uh, bronzer. And this is a Morphe M530. 
Now for my eyelids, I'm going to take, this is the um, Mineralized Skin Finish uh, Powder from MAC. This is in the shade Dark. And I'm going to use this to blend on my crease and all over my lid. And we just want a little bit of color on our lids. This is a Morphe M441. And I'm just using a little bit of pressure, just very lightly applying this on my crease. And I'm going to bring a little bit on my lower lash line. And that's all that I'm going to do to my eyes. I'm going to put a little bit of my highlight on my inner quarter. And I'm going to take the Anastasia Beverly Hills and Breezy. And popping that on my inner corner for my blush I'm going to take the color Bellissimo from a bake powder blush bla from a bake powder blush by Milani and I'm going to take this big fluffy brush this is from Real Techniques again and this is the dual fiber face brush it has a, like a little bit of a luminosity to it and for highlight, I'm going to use, again, the Anastasia uh, Umbreezy. I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit of fleck, uh, freckles, and I'm going to use the Freck product. And... take the shade Mocha by Makeup Geek and I'm going to smudge that on my upper lash line. I don't want to wear liner because I don't want obviously as harsh of a look and I'm just going to take that and smush it on, smush it, smudged it on my lash line. And then with your finger, you can just go in and kind of like blend the color on the lid. So kind of like it's like a, um, it's like fading upward. And I'm going to put in a little bit of mascara. I'm going to first coat my lashes. I'm not sure if I'm going to wear la um, falsies today. I don't know. I'm going to see. So I'm going to curl my lashes. So I think, I mean, it looks very well put together. I'm going to use my favorite. This is the Colourpop Volumizing Mascara. Okay, so for my waterline, I can't decide if I want to do like a bronze gold color or I want to do like white and or cream. I'm gonna do the, the gold bronze color and see how that looks. This is the NYX Retractable Eyeliner in the shade Gold. For my lips, I'm gonna line them first with the Jordana Lip Liner in the color Bare Blush. And I need to sharpen it first. <laughs> And then for my lips, I'm going to take, um, this is a color, but it's a color Bare Necessities, and it was a collab. But you can just wear any, like, nudie color. So that's it for this tutorial. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe in the little button down there. As always, all of the products that I use in this video are going to be linked down in the description box, as well as all of my social media. And until then, I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye!